Hey, what's up YouTube? This is Bart the Barber. I'm over here at Custom Made Barbershop in Jacksonville, Florida. Today I want to make a video about this trimmer right here. This is, to me, in my opinion, this is one of the most popular trimmers out here on the market. But this is the cordless T-Outliner. So y'all stay tuned and I'll tell y'all everything that I know about this trimmer. Okay, we're back. Now, like I said before, this is one of the most popular trimmers, I think, in the U.S. amongst barbers, okay? Most barbers use these trimmers, but most barbers use the corded version of these trimmers. These are fairly expensive trimmers, but I think that they are a must-have to any barber that has a lot of traffic, a lot of clientele. You got to have more than two trimmers, if you ask me, because sometimes trimmers go down, sometimes they get loose, they, uh... The blades get loose and they don't cut as, as sharp as they should. So you got a backup one, of course. Now the backup one, sometimes they might go out. Normally not in the same day, but I'm sure it's quite possible. That's why I said it's always good to have a third one. So what I normally do is carry four trimmers. I only have two plugged in now, but I always keep four of them on deck, ready to go. Okay, so like I said, these are a must have. They're wireless, so it's really, Really convenient for you to walk around the chair, not worry about getting snagged up by cords and stuff like that. So this is a really, 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 uh, 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 what do you say, uh, how do I say it, uh, convenient trimmer, okay? And it hits just as hard as just the regular T-outliners with the cord. But the only problem, the only difference to me is two things, okay? Now the blades are interchangeable from the regular corded T-outliner to the cordless T-outliner. The only difference is... On the moving blade on the inside, it's a this one, the cordless is attached to a plastic piece. Now that plastic, black plastic piece, uh, comes actually with the blade, but you can remove that plastic part of the moving blade and purchase a regular T-outliner corded blade and make it interchangeable. Now there is a difference between the screws here of the corded and the cordless uh, T-outliners, but that shouldn't you know hinder any change of blade or anything like that both screws fit so they are interchangeable no problem now like I said the only piece the only difference is on this moving blade on the inside there's a black plastic piece that holds the moving blade and the regular corded T outliner does not have that piece on there but the cordless one has it so you can just remove that black plastic piece from this corded T outliner put it on a regular and these uh, T-Outliner blade and uh, it'll work interchangeably. Now they also sell the T-Outliner cordless blades as well and it comes with that black piece but you don't have to buy that. I'm, from what I understand it's a few more dollars more but nothing to where it hurts your pocket but if you just want to save a buck or two you can just go ahead and get the regular T-Outliner blade. You can also get the GTX blade as well. That's normally what I do but this isn't a GTX blade but they're all interchangeable. Okay, now, it comes with the Andes logo right here, and it's a blue light. Once you put it on the charging port, that blue light turns on. That lets you know that the device is charging, which is a good thing because you'd hate to be, I'd hate to be cutting all day thinking that these are on the charger and they're not charging. So, that's a good tool to let me know that this thing is getting charged up. Another cool quality, uh, this is a minor difference, is this right here. The switch right here is black. Now, they're normally like a maroonish, purplish type of color. But there are T-outliners with a cord that have the black switch on there, but not very much of them. I noticed that it come with the uh, combo set when they have this little black switch, but that's just me thinking and, you know, from what I observe, probably not important. Okay, so uh, like I said, it's a very good uh, trimmer. The only difference, like I said, was the blade. And this trimmer isn't as powerful as the corded trimmer but it's, it hits just as good I never had an issue with it 
It always came through just like the corded one. The only thing is like I could feel that there's a difference in power, but like I said, it's just as good and uh, I don't have any complaints. Never did and I doubt that I ever will have complaints. Now it comes with a nice lithium ion battery, holds charged for a very long time. I, like I said, never had any complaints. It sounds good, it feels good. Only thing I'm worried about is dropping it, but I never dropped it. And uh, I'm sure if you drop it, you probably break the blade just like any other trimmer. But like I said, it sounds good if you keep it well maintained. I think it'll last forever. I had mine for about four months now. It's a new product, it's a really good product. I don't see anything wrong with this trimmer. So, you know, some people do reviews on trimmers and they find issues with it. Nothing wrong with this one. The corded one, to me, is a little more durable because you can feel the durability in the corded one. The cordless one kind of feels a little light, which is good because a lot of barbers don't like heavy trimmers or clippers. Me, I don't mind. I don't think any clippers heavy based off what I've been using. I think all of them are pretty good. There's some lighter than others, but this one here is kind of light, but it's good. It works for me. Um, if you guys like this review, because I don't really know much to say, what else to say about them, but that they're really good trimmers. So if you guys like this review, you can go ahead and hit like. I want you guys to su subscribe to my channel. Add me on Instagram. I want to shout out to Barber Luminati. That's my brother Rick. Um, I want you guys to show him some love. Like his channel. Follow his Instagram. Let him know I shot him out. That way he shot me out on his channel as well. And I'll see you guys soon. Peace.